What up everybody, welcome back to Case Digital. In today's video, we are answering the question of how to append to a list in Python. So without further ado, let's hop right in and start coding. So to append to a list in Python is actually quite simple, and here's why. In this example, I have set up just a list that just has the numbers one through four, and then I'm just gonna print this out. So if I run this, you'll essentially just see my current list that has the values one, two, three, four. Um, again, if you haven't watched one of my previous videos, I talk about how to create lists, whether it's from using the list constructor or using these brackets. And when you print a list out, you'll see these brackets to, to show that this is actually a list object. And if I wanted to append to it or just add to it, a simply all I simply have to do, um, and I'm just gonna copy this, bring this over here, and you just have to do dot append. You just use the dot append function. And I just put in, say, let's put in five. And I run this, and what you're gonna see is now my list, so here's my initial list, one, two, three, four, and now my appended list, one, two, three, four, five. It just takes that five, adds it to the end of, that's what a pen does. It'll just take, take the five and just add it straight to the end. And it just takes one object at a time. And that's the one thing that you just gotta catch is if I were to do something like, you know, if I wanted to do five through five and six, or five and yeah, five and six, and I tried to append this, I'm gonna get an error. And that's because, as this says, the list.append takes exactly one argument. So let's talk about what you can do if you wanted to add multiple arguments at one time. Hey, I just wanna jump in real quick, say thank you so much for watching the video so far. If it's providing you value, please click that like button below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so we can learn more about software development and programming. And well, speaking of programming, let's get right back to it. So to append multiple items to a current list, because as we just saw, if I just do five, comma six and try it in the append function, it doesn't work because append only takes one. So essentially if I wanted to append multiple items, well, what do you do? Well, there's two ways that you can do it. You can either do some list, um, li like combining of lists. You can use another method that I'll probably talk about later um, that uses extend or you can just put it all together or you can use loops. And so what I'm talking about is essentially like, I could say one, one method is essentially to go list plus equals and I'm just gonna say five and six. If I do this, what you're gonna see is you'll see our current our initial list and then hey look our new list of five and six because if I were just to do something like this list dot append and say hey like look I'm appending a list it's just gonna it's gonna create the same thing well does it and the answer is no and that's because append will take the object that you're giving it and just append it right at the end of the list so if that object is a number it's gonna append a number if that object's a float it's gonna put a float if it's a list it's gonna put a list as it did here another list inside of the overarching list that you're appending to. If it's a dictionary, it's gonna put it there. So if you want something that looks more of like one comma two comma three comma four comma five comma six comma, you're essentially gonna to have to do something where, like I just showed you, you're gonna to have to do the list plus equals um, five and six, which this is also called basically extend. Um, and there's that. Or what you can do is you can just simply use, like I mentioned, a for loop or, or any loop really. And I'm, in this case, I'm gonna use a loop or say for item in, and I'm gonna say five and six. And then we're gonna say dot append item. Now what you'll see is this will give us the exact same list that's we're, that we just did before. So there's a couple ways that you can use to um, append items to a list in Python. Whether it's just a single item, just use the append function like I'm doing here. If it's you're trying to combine two lists, use the you know use list addition is essentially what I call it, um, where you can combine two lists that way. And that's pretty much it. It's pretty simple to append to a list in Python. If you're having any troubles with it, leave your comments or, or leave your questions down below in the comments and I'll, just read, uh, I'll try to make a video or just answer them straight away in the comments. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Let's keep on programming with one another and helping each other learn and grow in Python and in software development. And until next time, keep on programming.